Good evening, Toastmasters and guests. My life has consisted of many fragments. Uh, I've had an industrious work ethic, tenacity, and passion, yet I've lacked some of the financial rewards that, that have traditionally accompanied those, and I would like to improve upon those in the, in the near future. Many of my pursuits have been diverse and disjointed. Um, uh, in Mr. Warner's eighth grade economics class, we, we played uh, a game called the economics game, where we each selected a company and tried to reap the greatest profits for a quarter. My company was Coca-Cola. I made the mistake of ordering a million tons of corn syrup. <laughs> Needless to say, we had to rent the local fairgrounds to house the sweet goodness. <laughs> oh, open happiness, right? Um, and uh, we dropped to third place. I also came in fifth place in the Northern California Scholastic Chess Championships. But about this time, I actually started uh, taking tennis very seriously. It was a 20-year cooperative and at times cutthroat uh, tennis odyssey. And um, I remember on... On Cal Riverside's third place national championship team, our number seven through thirteen uh, singles players often played other schools who were ranked for, who had players who were ranked from one to six because we had such a deep bench. Our number thirteen player was actually ranked sixty in Southern California, eighteens. So during one of the such during one of these tournaments, um, I actually got hit in the stoic orbs during the warm-up. Um, and I was as I was desperately hobbling around trying to regain my wind, my coach yelled out, son, in this case, walk it off. And um, basically um, I, I, I gutted out a ball breaking 6 4 in the third set loss, and Coach Riley remarked, Well, there's, at least there's nothing wrong with his tennis. Um, but it was, it was a lot of fun. Um, uh, uh, I majored in English literature. Um, in undergraduate, um, but law school was about 50% more difficult than undergrad, and I was um, four tenths of the student body got axed or was on academic probation, and and I was I was emotionally unprepared to brave the pressure cooker, yet yet I survived. Um, uh, every Thursday evening, we ventured out into the night for bar review. Um, we studiously frequented various watering holes, and I was one of the few that didn't drink like a fish, and one of the far between who never sat for the bar exam. Uh, since 2008, I've written three books, The Ascent of a Barbarous Court Squatter, Sporty Reflections of a Court Recidivist, and Someday You'll Know Me, in parentheses, open parentheses, until then, comma, I'll vent, close parentheses, exclamation, exclamation point, close parentheses. I'll talk more about these in future speeches. But, uh, for now, let's just say that with the ascent of a barbarous court squatter, there was enough theory, theoretical, uh, intellectual, cerebral 
uh, uh, nonsense to to prevent confabulation. Uh, <laughs> I. Uh, Competition tennis, academia, and writing are unorthodox pursuits that require tremendous luck and marketing efforts to, to yield gains. Um, I would like to continue in such pursuits while hedging my bets at the same time and landing a, a steadier job uh, to make up for the practicalities of our modern life. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah.